Vermont is one of two states where there's no explicit age, requi age eligibility requirement. All you have to have done is lived here for four or more years, which I've tripled and then some. I became very dedicated to the idea of running for governor, and so I started doing my research and reaching out to people, and I realized that despite my age, there was uh, more support than I would have imagined as I was putting my feelers out. I am running to win, but I would very happily settle for sending a message about young people in politics because for a long time we've seen, and even more so recently, we've seen a lot of apathy from uh, young people when it comes to politics. I think there's this idea that there's no such thing as an honest politician. And I'd say that's part of why I'm running, is to show young people and everybody that we can have a governor who doesn't have a personal agenda, but rather a public agenda that he wants to do to better the state. My real goal is I want voters to have every possible option on the ballot. I want voters to have a lot of choices about ideology and about party and about uh, political issues. We're going to have a practical but progressive agenda that we're going to try to implement. We are going to fight for universal health care and uh, we're going to have, and if elected I will, um, a big focus in my campaign, especially after recent events, has been protecting Vermonters' civil rights and liberties. I would venture that 2017 is the most important year in recent history to be involved in politics. Every norm about politics has been shattered since the election. We are going to be dealing with the effects of this current administration for a long time to come, is what I believe. Even before they're old enough to vote, we need young people to be involved because we need them to be able to say that they need to be able to fight for their future. I think we're going to really focus our campaign on um, kind of an almost Obama-esque youth and vitality aspect. This isn't a kids or adults issue anymore and that we elected our only our oldest our oldest president ever and he tweets like a kindergartner i'd rather fight uh i'd rather i'd rather lose a fight with a lot of visibility mm -hmm. than lose a fight quietly <laughs>